that one guy through emulation got um free riders to work with the normal controller. So I have no idea how the a uh, fuck they'll do that was gun it was the gun stringer. The funny thing is because that game is like you're holding a puppet, you could actually maybe map it to a Wii Remote nonchunk. Fuck oh, God. It was old west, so of course you're No what? What's the one we got from the old west stage? I'm confused by that because they don't. I think it's the polka dot one. No, we had that at the beginning. I don't think we have any more, which is confusing. How would you bring that? Let's do a gradient. Two ton. Nice. I'm confused by that because I don't. Oh, no, they're... Oh, yeah, they're special unlocks. Because... Or they just get, well, at least you do just get them, and they're not... Hold on. Damn it. That's the case, and I can... Change. Buy everything! That's my point. I got money. To at least... I thought they were becoming unlocked for purchase. It'll take like nearly all the money. The coins are literally just the costume. Yeah, the coins are literally just that. And especially if you're going to be earning costumes in every stage, trash. Oh, we'll do the cow pattern. Ninja time. Go ninja, go ninja, go. Let's go. Okay. Well, I missed something. Minjutsu, the art of profits. Well, I get something at the beginning. At least I now understand this game. And after getting fooled a couple of times, I know what I'm looking for. Every classic ninja story begins in a village. Looks like it won't be going that way. I always love when a Japanese developer makes a super Japanese level. Like how that one level... Like how that one level in Re uh, Vengeance is a like, oh we got it. one of those you know on the screen that yes, yeah. Like how oh, that one level in Re uh, Vengeance you just randomly end up in like a uh, Japanese like pagoda garden, and I believe the explanation for that literally is just one of the like people working at that office was a massive weeb. Ninja stealth section. See, there's a secret passage around here. Alright, uh, can you keep going? It's the rock. <laughs> Just as surprised as you are. Oh, it's those little pinwheel things that that was that collectible on like a bunch of old Capcom games. Yes. I can't remember what the hell that thing was called. Ha! Give me the three coins. Even though if like 
There better be other shops later, because if not, that means coins are super fucking pointless. Ninja Peach. Doesn't seem to be vibrating. Ooh, wall jump. Heh. <laughs> I have that one ninja technique. Oh, and it changes texture, that's amazing. Ah! Yep. <laughs> <laughs> that's amazing. Okay. Hard in the grass. Okay. Yep, okay, you can dash a little bit. Oh, it was like a posing spot? Eh. No, but I get you up here. -ish. There might be something up here. No. Oh, there's the pose. So then you get one of the starry things. And... Seems like that's just what that was for. Because we also need the bow. Yeah, we haven't found that one yet. If I get all the things but miss the bow, I'm going to laugh my ass off. Yes. You can't see me. Okay, roof thing. Good time for the wall, huh? Yep. Mm. Oh yeah, you can just... I was going to say, I feel like because your thing can sail that you probably can't be seen by that at all. <laughs> okay, there was also... It is... It's on the roof, but I don't... I... Well, there, there's a staircase. I feel like you might have to maybe go all the way, like, over and then you run across the rooftops because there's a staircase and still shit going up. See... Look, there's level design here. Yeah. Except uh, no. No. Oh, hold on. Mm. It's up on that roof. Also, that scroll has one of them on it, so... Oh, 
Can you jump on the lantern? Oh. Oh, no. We're overcomplicating that. Just jump on the lantern. And then now you can... Platform up here. One of the star things on that scroll, so I guess you have to. What? That. Can you all hide? No. Because we haven't seen the bow yet. Ha! <laughs> Doing the bamboo pipe thing. Oh, speaking of. Taking no prisoners. <laughs> so far, so good, because he was big and red, and we haven't missed anything. No. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Substitution. Scrolls are all mine. Oh, you can, before you keep running off it. What? Well, one, can you hit the substitution thing for anything? There's a pose spot. I was going to say there's also a pose spot. It, remember, check. Like, unless the game has a giant timer or something on the screen, don't, like, immediately leave the screen whenever. Damn it. Yes. <laughs> Just three left, and I, and because it's a hidden spot, that feels like the last one on that screen. So I would. That is the last. Th I would assume. So. It's one. But, however, yeah. <laughs> Going around, it's just to make sure. Okay. Doing amazing. An auto an auto scroller so it will probably you know oh damn oh, I... ah good eh, funny two more okay so yeah it's It's an auto scroller, but unlike the other one, you can sort of control your like path and stuff a lot more. So because you can control it a lot more. Damn it! I had to save that guy. Oh, wow. I know I had to save that guy, so we missed one. Probably. Oh, oh, that's gonna be annoying. I literally missed the one. Because I missed time. Uh, oh no, there's, there's actually still more level. So there might still actually be one left. Nope, it's but... taping the gun. We missed one game. One freaking game! You need the freaking game! <laughs> of course. Of oh, fucking course. Of oh, fucking course. God damn it. Up at the top. I bet if I save him, I get. <laughs> if I save him, I bet I get one. That's the only answer. So I'm gonna have to cut the game! I did fucking damn it. I had it all in a quick I mean
God damn it. Yep. Uh. Got it. Ooh. Uh -huh. And then this is actually close enough to the end of the stage. Stage, I might stay in. It was just a I, I would just recommend to stay in because. No. <laughs> Fuck you, buddy. Might have showed the entire wave. Okay, it's, it wasn't too bad. I just didn't know what the timing was. Because I kept missing, because she arts kind of weird, so I just waited. Seven hundred twenty-two coins. Uh, there better be shops on the other floors because if not, I'm sorry. What is the point of those? It's time for the question of the day and my overall thought on the topic. So, anyway, what is your opinion on Ninja Peach? Overall, I really enjoyed Ninja Peach, but a lot of people hate these levels which is incredibly interesting to me because i thought people would enjoy a transformation that is a bit more action focused which is the reason i enjoy the ninja peach levels and a lot of people seem to not like the stealth but i thought the stealth was fine since the stealth sections are normally overall pretty fast. And even if you get caught, you do not really face a harsh penalty. So the stealth sections are fine. I enjoyed the action since these levels are a lot more action focused. And the transformations that I really enjoyed the most are basically the more action-focused ones. And I do wish this game had been a lot more action-focused since the action levels are overall really fine. And surprisingly challenging at points, all things considered, which just goes to show you they could have made a action game starring Princess Peach, and I think that would have been fine. But to get back on topic, I thought the Ninja Peach levels were fine enough. I don't mind the stealth. And I enjoyed the action portions of being a ninja. So this specific transformation is a personal favorite. But anyway, you can leave your thoughts, opinions, and answers in the comments. Or you can leave them on social media or of mine. Social media links as well as my Discord links are in the video description. Now, as always, I need to be a shill for a minute if you subscribe to the channel. And if you follow me on social media, that really helps our communities grow. But anyway, I hope you all enjoyed the video and I hope I will see you all next time. So as always, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, or good night, everybody. I hope you come back someday. See you later.